Hello everybody and welcome back to another wonderful episode. So on the last episode we finished off in... Oh, wait for it, wait for it. We ended off in Farmington. So for this one, I already pre-planned this one. We are going to actually go to Colorado because if you haven't noticed, we have actually been itching our way west. So I have been trying to get to Colorado. Colorado is the destination I wanted to get to. So we are going to take the Colorado, the highest price one. Okay, and if you did notice, I did change a few of the settings. So there was a lot of latency issues in the previous videos that I have been doing and it wasn't really coming out the best when we were at, when I was actually doing them. So I turned all my settings down, I turned them to low. I'm hoping that that takes care of the problem that I was having with all of the low frame rates. So I'm hoping that I can get the frame rates to go up a little bit more so that way it's a little bit smoother of an actual video for you guys and it's not just a bunch of skips all over and you're not seeing everything. So I did turn, the, turn this down. I am hoping that I can get that video card sometime in the near future to be able to get those back up so that way we're able to have the better video. Okay, but for right now, I wanted to see for this video how it was if I turned all of the settings down to low, just that way we can get a little bit better with it. So we do have a little bit of a drive here. Let's see what we got. So we have one mile to our destination, almost there. Let's go ahead and turn that map back off. We realized last time that we actually could do it without that map. So we are coming up on that destination here. Got a little bit left before we get there. So if it does cut down on the uh, latency issues that I've been having with the frames per second, I'm, I'm thinking we might keep it like this for a while. If it doesn't really help out that much with the frames per second, then we'll probably just go back to how it was before. Return it in here. And then we're going to be picking up our freight. Do you want a Pueblo? Yes, we are. So let's go ahead and find that load. Where's our load at? There's one thing I wish they would add into here is giving you the actual location of your pickup. Oh, it's saying it's back behind us. It's saying it's back over there. Oh, there it is. Saw it right back there. Saw the little arrow. So let's go ahead and get back over there. Yeah, I'm half tempted to use the uh, circus music for this one. Just trying to find our load. But we are almost there. Oh uh, no. Looking really like we're not supposed to be over there. Maybe it's over on the other side. So let's go ahead and take a drive around. Is it down over here? Let's find out. Got another exit right there. I was saying it was down over here. Oh, there it is. And it is. ahead and get lined up on here. See if we can do this in one try. What do you think? I don't think it's gonna work. Just as I thought. Off by just a little bit. It's a little bit different seeing it with the graphics how they are. I 
and there we go we got all loaded up let's go ahead and get this destination done so it is a little bit longer than the last time so we will have a few of time lapses in this one looks like we're clear there and clear there still clear so then we're taking it right out of here yeah going down another road we have not been down so it looks like heading towards Albuquerque yeah. nice place in Albuquerque they got a another another shop there for us another uh, what is it home base There are all steps, and we'll, you will go. Ooh, that trailer got close over there. So I'm hoping that video guard does come soon. I did get the rest of the actual computer already built. I have everything put in there. The only thing now I am waiting on is a graphic card, which is about 99% of people that are building computers right now. Everybody that wants a new computer, they're having to wait on a graphics card. Unless you want to have about a 10 year old card. So I found there's actually cards that are the same card that I have in this one that are for sale. However, there's no last gen or current gen that are available. So, yeah. I wish that they could get that market back going on there and getting actual cards out to people. That would be nice to actually be able to have those. So yeah, I could upgrade the graphics in here. I'm hoping it comes soon. I still haven't heard any news on if they've shipped it or not. The last thing I heard was that they were back ordered and they still did not have any to be able to send out. So I'm hoping it comes in soon. Hoping. I do know it's going to be shipped to UPS. So, yeah. I just, yeah. That, that, that's opening a whole can of worms on when graphics cards are going to be going in. You can actually watch about 500 videos on YouTube about when graphics cards are going to be back. does look a little weird on the dash. I can barely make out what is actually saying on the instrument cluster. Uh, it looks like we're on 35 now. We're in a 45 zone, so. Looks like I'm going just a little bit over 45, but that's okay. Hey, Volvo truck dealership. Don't worry, one day we will get one of them. We will get a Volvo at one point, because we got we gotta have employees sometime, don't we? Gotta have some employees. Okay, so we got a little while before we can get there. I am trying to cut out some of these red lights that we're having to go through because it's pretty boring just sitting at a red light. So I am cutting those out ones so you guys don't have to actually watch those. And then looks like we're going to be taking a left so I'm going to squeeze in here behind this. Behind the... Oh, he's going to stop pretty fast. But we're not making a left here, we're making it on the next one. Okay, so we got done with that light. Yeah, these lights have been lasting forever. You guys don't know about it because I'm just cutting over them. But they have actually been going for quite a long time. Quite a long time that I've been sitting at all these lights. I was hoping they wouldn't be that long, but it seems like they are going to be very long lights. And we got another one. Yes, I, I think this video is going to be called How Many Stoplights Are There In This Game?
Okay, and as we said, we are going to try to hit these viewpoints. So, let's go ahead and see this viewpoint we got here. Uh, I gotta escape out of there. I'm rolling backwards. So let's put the park brake on, then we'll do the viewpoint. That seems like a better idea. So you can tell the graphics are on low. So we will have to hit this back up when we get to a better graphics. I will tell you that much. I do want to see this with the better graphics because even with the low graphics, it still looks really nice. It does look like a very nice scenery. Yeah. I don't mind that at all. Okay, and we are back now. If you notice, I did change a few things while we were away. I changed a little bit of the settings. I decided to try medium to see if that's still going to be as... Uh, what is it that I'm trying to say? Still as laggy as it was before. So the low settings that was... I could barely stand it myself. So I wanted to try the mediums just to see how it is when YouTube compresses everything. Because I can do everything through uh, OBS and it can look perfect to me. Like I can record a video and it doesn't look like there's any lag whatsoever when I'm actually doing the video, when I'm actually putting it out. But as soon as I upload it to YouTube, their compression algorithm, something happens and it just continuously made it look like it was laggy. So I wanted to do two different settings, one of them with the low settings, one with medium, just to see if medium was going to work or if low was going to be the only one I could use to try to keep from the lag that was happening. There was a really low frame rate and I really didn't like that because again, through my files that I have, that I actually sit there and I edit, I try to do everything for, there was no frame rate issue. However, as soon as I uploaded to YouTube, that's where the frame rate issues were actually happening. So I, I wanna see if by changing around, like if low is only gonna work or if I could do medium. If I can do medium, which this is medium, which we're on right now, it's the preset medium. So that way we can actually do the game and actually enjoy some okay graphics. Because before the graphics were really bad and I, I really didn't like them. But if it's the only thing that's going to work, it's the only thing that's going to work. I'm not going to try to destroy my videos by making extremely laggy videos just so I can have a video that doesn't lag but yet the graphics are terrible and you don't want to watch them because the graphics are so bad. So I'm trying to find that happy medium where the graphics are still, still okay however it's not so low a frame rate that you can't stand to watch it. And yes, we did end up having to get stuck behind a really slow truck now. Oh, we got away from one of them to get it behind another one. And it's a 65 zone and he's doing 45. Hopefully he picks it up pretty soon. We're going downhill, so it shouldn't be hard. Looks like we're coming up into those twilight hours, too. Oh, come on, truck. You can go faster than this. I know you can. You're going 40. Then again, I don't know what he has in his trailer. He, he might have a really heavy load, even though we're going downhill. Yes, we are going downhill because I'm taking off the accelerator and I'm not slowing down much. I'm actually speeding up right now. 
So, and of course he braked for this corner. Let's go ahead and flip on the lights. Apparently I didn't have them all the way and I just had parkings on. So we got another fine. Is anybody keeping track how many fines I've actually received since the first video? That would be a pretty interesting thing to know. How much I paid in fines. On top of that, how much I, how many I've paid in accident fines that actually weren't my fault. That would be another nice thing to know. So I might actually have to go through these one day and actually count up how many fines I've actually received. Okay. But seeing as how we're just still stuck behind this slow truck, we will start going over to a time lapse and we will enjoy the music and the scenery. Okay, everybody, welcome back. We are almost to our destination. Almost there. And if you did notice, I did run a red light. So the reason for that is we have six minutes to our destination. We have one minute until we're supposed to rest. So I'm just trying to get to this destination. That right there on the left-hand side, that's where I'm going to rest when it becomes time to rest. But for right now, I'm just trying to get to our destination because we are so close, it's not even funny right now. So once we can get there, I can get this delivered. I can end the video without having to do the whole resting section because it was so close, so close. So I'm just gonna finish this one off right here. Then I actually might actually make it up to that other rest area, it looks like. Looks like we got a uh, gas, uh, three places to rest, and a mechanic there so we can get all three of them done in one area. So I can repair the truck just a little bit. Was that our turn? I think that was our turn. There we go, now it's opening for us. So we're coming in and we have to go through to over there. Let me see if we can come around this way. Shouldn't be anybody working, so I don't know what all these cars are doing here. You know, shouldn't be cars. And there's where we need to go, so I'm going to do this this way.
Okay, so we have cut out a little bit of it. I couldn't figure out how to actually get the truck in to where it was or how where it actually was and the direction that I was supposed to be going into. So I did a little bit of driving around trying to figure out how to do all of that and finally figured it out. Now we are getting it into its spot. Yeah, it's taken me a little while and I really didn't feel like doing the uh, circus music again. And yeah, we've gotten a lot of sleep avoidance fines. A lot. I'll tell you that much. Because it, it, yeah. Okay, so we got another excellent delivery here. Good thing we got a good payday on this one because most of it went to fines. So we are almost like to our next level, which is going to be level 10. Uh, made 15,732 from that one. So as I said, I will go over, I will do the sleep, I will get gas, everything like that. And I will repair the truck and then we will see you on the next episode. So until then, drive safe and we will see you guys next time.